Hey YouTube. So now that this is all de-stumped and all that fun stuff, I uh, had the bright idea since I called around and I can't afford anybody to pour a 38 by 18 foot by 6 inch pad. Um, since I can't afford that, I have to figure out a different way. So there's an, I put a post on Facebook stating, hey, you know, looking for cement fill. Uh, my idea is that I get in the B gravel or P gravel and uh, compact it all down, put down my layer of uh, poly, and then uh, this guy started from Google, he started bringing me a ton. He's got, I guess he's got a whole house foundation. So I'm going to smash it up into usable pieces, put it over there. Um, the nice part is by the time I'm done, I'm probably going to end up having a six to eight inch pad. Uh, so I'm going to put the poly down and then I'm just going to line all these little pieces in and then I'll create the level of the, uh, the pad about an inch to two inches above all of them. And I'll just, I'll rebar in between all the cracks and then I'll just basically fill it all in with as much cement as I can afford to put together myself in a stand cement mixer. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, but yeah, I'm pounding away at these uh, nice slabs of cement that I dropped off today. I guess he's got a lot. Uh, he said two full dump trucks, but he can't get a hold of a dump truck, so he's just got a, uh, a dump trailer that he's bringing out. Uh, this is two loads. So he says he's got about an, at least another five loads. Uh, he's going to bring three tomorrow, and then he says as he goes, he'll bring them. I would imagine he's probably got a, like, probably 10 to 15 to 20 loads more. But uh, I might have to cut them off at one point once I feel like I have enough cement. Hopefully this is a secure way to build a pad. But, um, like I said, I will be running steel rebar reinforcements through the whole thing. Uh, but hey, this is what I can afford. This is the best idea I had, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to use existing concrete to fill in my concrete pad uh, as concrete fill. So I'm going to keep smashing away. I've only gotten a little bit done so far. Um, it's a hell of a lot of concrete, and he's bringing through more of those tomorrow. So, hey guys. So, just been sledgehammering up cement. It's a, it's a fun one. Hey, relax. Calm down. So yeah, this is what I'm doing. Got another load coming in about an hour. Um, I've been pounding away at it for about three hours. It's going well. I'm almost at the original loads. This L block here was the original load, so if I can clean up the rest of this stuff by the time he gets back, I'll be happy. Um, dogs found something they wanted to bark at, so they did that. Uh, another cool little thing. Check out this bike my buddy gave me. Some guy who let me borrow the sledgehammer gave me that thing. Like, So now I can... Uh, once I get uh, some of the things picked back up on it, like just, you know, some regular tune-up stuff, I'm going to actually start taking extra bike rides and uh, hopefully wear them down. That would be a lot of fun for him and for me, not having to put up with them the rest of the day. Um, so, yeah, keep smashing. I'll talk to you soon. All right, end of day, guys. Uh, it's probably around 5 o'clock. I'm tired of smashing stuff up. Um, kind of cleaned up a little bit. These uh, old curbs are hard to break, but the ones I am breaking, I'm being able to move over there. So once this is all formed in, I'll lift them in and I'll use them to uh, to help extend my my sides and basically be my curbs. And then I'll just pour uh, you know rebar in between them and pour cement over top of them and in between them. So um, this is what I was able to smash today. There was a small pile here from yesterday, but yeah. Looking pretty good. It's a hefty amount. He's uh, he hasn't brought me the third load today, so I only smashed up two loads today. Um, but when he brings me the third load, I think he says he's got about six more loads. So uh, you know, I might only take three more, maybe four more of them. But any leftover cement, I'll use to line the uh, the creek. So we'll see what happens. Um, if I had something to pick these slabs up and use those to line the creek, I'd be way ahead of the game, but I don't, so this is what I'm using. Have a good one, YouTube. I'll see you in the next day or two. Got more cement to smash. Got to start getting the uh, B gravel in to 
fill in some stuff and uh, level off the foundation and then build the forms and start filling it in. So that's all got to happen soon.